<laughs> yeah, sometimes you just don't know how to start a video. I swear, I haven't made a video in like two or three weeks and I just forget how to make them. Hey, I woke up today to a Nintendo Direct. I think we all did. Where did that come from? Who knows? I haven't watched it yet. I figured we could watch it together. Um, I'm very excited. It's nice. It's nice to wake up to something from someone because this year is just really dragging its feet and it looks like we're getting a bunch of cool Mario stuff because yeah, 35th anniversary, 35 years of Mario already. Mario is five years older than me. I grew up playing Mario. I love Mario. Mario Odyssey, Mwah. might even play that on Twitch later tonight. Stop by if you want. We made partner by the way, so thank you for all your support over on Twitch. I'd appreciate it if you watched me over there. Uh, that said, I don't, I'm not like the biggest Mario. I mean, I enjoy Mario as much as the next guy. Uh, next year is Zelda's 35th anniversary, and if you know a little thing about me, it's that I love my little fairy man in green. And I really hope that Zelda gets the same treatment that Mario is getting. I mean, we've already had leaks about Skyward Sword coming to Switch. Uh, Nintendo recently renewed Ocarina of Time's trademark. So, I mean, there are signs pointing towards whatever we're about to watch right now in this Direct for Mario. There are signs pointing towards maybe getting something like this next year for Zelda. I mean, Mario and Zelda, they go together like peaches and ham. <laughs> Whatever, let's just get into it and watch it. I'm excited. As I said, I haven't- I don't- did I say it? I haven't watched it yet. I wanted to watch it with you guys. I've tried really hard not to see any spoilers, but I mean, just looking at my sub feed, it's like... I can't- I can't get away from it. Thank you for watching my video today, because I know that I'm gonna be like the last person to put this up. I'm already filming mine after everyone else has done theirs. But you're still here watching me. And I appreciate that. Let's see what we got here. 16 minutes of goodness. Ignore my really dorky Gamer Boy headset. Um, my good- my good one's broke. I gotta- I gotta buy some better ones. Oh, Like two seconds into it! That's a really cute little graphic. 35th anniversary, Super Mario Bros. Look at them all! Look at Peach sitting next to Mario like he has a chance. It's been 35 years, buddy. You ain't getting that. I like how she's even kind of looking at Bowser. I, I think she has a thing for Bowser. Uh, we all played Mario Odyssey. It's very clear that she kind of likes being kidnapped at this point. Here's a classic way to play Super Mario Brothers. Uh, don't we already have that? Oh, what? A plus control what? pad is included. So what? you can play the game smoothly. What? Yeah, that's not an actual handheld, is it? That's a, it? that's a game, right? That's not like an actual... <gasps> What? I didn't know about that! That's so cool! That's so freaking cool! What the heck? I love- I have- I have a collection of Game & Watches. I love Game & Watches. They're the first Nintendo handhelds. That is so cool! This is pretty good. This- okay, this is pretty good, Nintendo. I am so glad this game is finally coming to Switch. I don't know how many times I've said it, how many times I've pleaded, begged, and asked Nintendo to bring this game. Uh, this is the best traditional 2D side-scrolling 3D interactive of this style of Mario game without going full 3D platformer. This is the best one. This is the cream of the crop. This is a 10 out of 10 Mario game. Like, I honestly, I much prefer the 3D Mario platformer games to the 2D side-scrolling games while the originals hold a very special place in my heart, but this game gives the 3D Marios a run for their money. It is so well designed, so perfectly crafted, so gorgeous, and so fun in every single element. I do not understand why in God's name they would port that other 2D Mario Deluxe game to Switch before porting this. It made no sense to me, especially when we already had Super Mario Maker 2. I'm going on a complete tangent now, but I am so glad we're getting this on Switch. Uh, I can't wait to play it with Kim. In fact, speaking of Twitch, that's a perfect game to play on Twitch with Kim. I can't wait. I can't- wait, what? Why was there a- Why was there a- like a Super Smash style plus? What are they adding? What are they including? What are they changing? What are they doing? What? <laughs> what? What does that mean? Oh, that's not until next year? I don't know what that Bowser Fury is, but it, they must be adding a lot into the game if it's not just a re-release that can come out this year. 35 players? 
This is so cool. Nintendo, Competing this is awesome. Online battle game. What? What? Oh Enemies no! Will be sent to other players' courses. Oh no! But it's like Tetris 99, but with Mario. Around. Is it free as well? That is so cool. That it, it's Tetris not. It's Mario 35. That's what they're gonna call it, Mario 35. For Mario Brothers 35, I told you. October 1st. I told you. I love that idea. I love. I can't wait for that. We've had three. This has been a great direct so far. Okay, wait. Is that what? What is that? Ugh! What am I looking at? <laughs> oh, oh, oh! No, they haven't. Have they made physical Mario Kart with a camera? What? That you play using your Switch? Oh my gosh, that's so cute. <laughs> that's such a good idea. That's so fun. How many people can play? Oh, no way. No way. You can make your own courses. Oh, and they've built like a... Oh my gosh, they've built, that is so fun. I wish I was a kid. I'm gonna love this, but I wish I was a kid for this. This is something I would have, when I was a kid, I used to build stuff like this for marbles. I used to make marble tracks around my room to see how far I could make a marble roll down tracks. And that is, that's such a me thing to do as a kid. What that game is, that is such a good idea. That makes my heart so happy. Oh my gosh. They've just Mario'd up everything. This is so good. They have gone Super all Super Mario themed furniture will be added to the Animal Crossing New what? Horizons game. Oh, yep. There's the shoes. Yeah, I kind of want the... That is pretty cute. I got to get Kim that. They have... They have... What haven't they... Got it. Finished it. It's behind me. Really good fun. They have... They have over Mario'd in the best way. In Super Mario All-Stars. Yep, not surprised. The audio and visuals are upgraded from the original. Oh, really now? That's fun. Today, that's really cute. I like how full circle we've gone to. We've gone from the old school Mario All-Stars to this is essentially the 2020 version of that All-Star. Mario 64. I, I can't wait to see how it looks. I knew about this. We, I've known about this for weeks, but I can't wait to see how it looks. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it looks the same. I mean, it looks touched up. It's a little cleaner around the edges, but that's the game, man. That's Mario 64 on Switch. Mario Sunshine. So many people are losing their minds right now. I wish this was more of a surprise to me because again, I've known about this for what feels like months at this point. I guess the only thing I don't know is the release date. Oh my, is it? Okay, now is it just one or one and two? Or is it just one? It looks great, widescreen, right? I mean, it originally wasn't, it was on the Wii, so it wasn't widescreen. It looks, oh my gosh, it looks really good. If you haven't played Mario Galaxy, I mean, a lot of people think it's the best out of all the Mario games and I, I can't fault them for thinking that. I mean, I preferred Odyssey, but it's a great game. Super Mario 3D All-Stars. It's so cool how we've come like full circle from the original 2D All-Stars to now. September 18. A limited run retail edition. Limited run edition retail. I gotta go to GameStop. I gotta hurry up. Uh, I better get one of those. Why is it limited? That's That was a really neat little Mario Direct. Uh, I really don't even know where to begin with that. That was the, I think that was honestly the best direct we've had in a long time. And I'm not even a huge Mario fan. I mean, I like Mario, but oh my gosh, did they pull out all the stops. Not only are they re-releasing like old games that are like HDified, which would be perfectly fine as like a celebratory thing for the 35th. They've given an all new handheld mini console thing, like a, a new Game & Watch. I can't believe the stops that Nintendo pulled out for this. As I said, oh my gosh, I am now realizing. As I said, I'm excited watching this because if you're a Zelda fan, Zelda's 35th is next year. And they can, oh, they cannot. <laughs> they cannot do my boy Link like that. To do all this for Mario and then do nothing or like not as much for Zelda. They have to. They got, and you know what? You know what I'm now realizing? There was a, there was a Zelda Game & Watch. There was that little flippy one and there was probably a, uh, the flat ones too. I have the flippy one 
upstairs right now. So they could re-release another game. They could start doing Game & Watches again and do a Zelda one next next year for the Zelda anniversary. I, I guarantee you that's their plan. I would buy a whole collection of these Game & Watches. I really would. Nintendo is seriously out here just making fun. They're just making pure, capsulated fun that as soon as you, you flick off the top, just fun explodes all over your face. They don't care about teraflops. They don't care about uh, super fast SSD drives. They're not looking to build a beast of a system. They're like Cyberpunk 2077. What's that? All they care about is making something fun. And they've made Mario Kart in real life with actual little racing toys. I love that idea. I, I am an I am a full-grown man-child, and I can't wait to play this. That was really awesome. What else can they do for the fans and for Mario? Perfect. This is great. I will stream on Twitch tonight. Uh, yeah. Check that out. Mario! Where was the Luigi love, though? Can we be real? That's, that's a lot of Mario, but Luigi's been there since the start, too. Can I point that out? Whatever. Love you guys.